kind of combined two things I was really interested in and sport for development and obviously the Olympic movement at the time. And um, the more I learned about it, the more I wanted to be involved with it. That's two-time Olympic gold medalist Rosie McLennan talking about her involvement with the organization Right to Play. And with parks around the country closed over COVID-19 concerns, she can't stress enough the importance of playing at home, not only for children, but everyone. Play is really powerful. And I think especially in a time like this where a lot of people are feeling anxiety and uncertainty, it can help uh, just like alleviate some of that stress. It can bring some joy into the I guess situation into your household. Rosie was training for the upcoming Tokyo Olympics when her life, like everyone else's, was changed because of COVID-19. But she's doing her best to keep a positive mindset. I think just getting active uh, every single day has been really important to just keep myself grounded and keep myself focused. I do think having fun with it is important. And I think one of the greatest opportunities that I've had recently is to, because I don't have the stress of having to compete at an Olympics in four months uh, or three months, whatever it is now, um, I can explore other games and other opportunities of like other activities. She's helping spread the word about right to play and that anyone can do these activities at home in self-isolation. I mean, with the games that they've created, uh, I mean, it's really cool. They've created this whole online platform with all these resources and games that have been adapted for the home um, on their website and using them, you can not only like just have some fun, but you can, teach your kids and you can open up these lines of conversation. But uh, one that's pretty easy for us to do right now is uh, one called I Like Math. And it's kind of similar to, I guess, like rock, paper, scissors. So you would do like, I like math and throw a number. Um, and again, there's variations, but the simple one is using one hand, you throw a number and then I see what you throw and you see what I throw and like mentally add it up and shout out the answer. Okay, why don't we do a quick demonstration for everyone at home? But let's do it standing on one foot. Ready? Three, three. I, I like, like math. math. Nine. Nine. Ah! <laughs> Not only a great Olympian, you're also great at math. They also have interactive games online where everyone can try to improve their vocabulary. And speaking of that, the National Spelling Bee, which has been broadcast around the world since 1945, has officially been C-A-N-C-E-L-L-E-D, canceled over COVID-19 concerns. Lindsay Dunn, City News, Toronto.